Oh, that's shaky. Hello, everybody. I still need to get a tripod for this stream. How's your day going? My day's going good, Happy. Thanks. Good. Ah, can't talk today. Thanks for being here. I'm ready to kill it today, guys. I'll be honest. I really wasn't feeling it for this stream today. But, you know, when the going gets tough, the tough get going, right? So we're here to do it. I'm looking great. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Is this the second stream? No, this is the third one now. We're on the third stream, day three. I'm taking Saturday, Sunday off, then we're right back on Monday. Let's try to mount this up here. Problem is, is it's really shaky because I'm a very heavy individual. Oh boy, here we go. Make that treadmill your bitch, I will. First incline increase of the day, thank you too. The Packard Goose. Give you a heart. Appreciate it, buddy. Let's do this. Five dollars, one percent. We'll do one point five. No, we'll do two. Because uh, somebody donated five yesterday, um, and I told them that I would start the incline higher for that. So I'm gonna keep good on that. Does it feel any easier than day one? Um. Honestly, it's been too soon to tell. I, I really couldn't tell you. Go, Carl, you're the best. No bad words, please. I don't know if I said any, but I'll try not to. It's really, really, swearing is something I've done for a long time. It's really hard for me to keep it under control, but I'll try. The treadmill is just being annoying. Uh. I'm not really sure what to say to that. Sorry about the shakiness. I'm a heavy guy. So this treadmill is a, uh... you should take off the helmet. It must be heavy to exercise. Nah, I'm gonna keep it up. All right, we got another one, five euros, which is pretty much almost a direct translation other than 41 cents. So that's another incline increase. We're at three already. So I'm at 3% incline with three miles an hour. As always, as this gets steeper, I usually have to turn the speed down just to uh, keep from wearing myself out too much or passing out or something. Still waiting for you to show us a cock on a stream. Damn. Okay, all right. I'd go get it now, but I really don't want to interrupt this. Pasta. No way. Is that you, Pasta? Is that my boy? Is that a soul? That's you, man. Holy shit. Thank you, Pasta. This is a guy. Pasta is one of my high school friends. He's a good dude. I appreciate you stopping by, man, and thanks for the, thanks for the incline increase. That that puts me at five now. Goodness gracious, five percent though, I can handle that. Whoopsies, let's go down. See, a salute for pasta. That's right. He's a good dude. Played a lot of Halo back in the days. Gears of War. He is. He's a good guy. And the profile picture is his dog, Asul. She's a very good girl. How old am I? I'm 32. Privyet tovarish. Boric. I'm not sure what Boric means, but I know Privyet tovarish means hello, brother. Hello, brother. Do well, man. All right, two bucks. That's definitely enough for an increase, and I really, really appreciate that donation, 717FAN. You're the best. All right, 5.5%. Just to show you guys I'm not fucking lying here, this is what I'm going to do. Three miles an hour. 
5.5%. Okay. You getting tired? No, not at all. Not yet. I'm sure by the time uh, 20 to 25 minutes comes around, I'll be eating those words. But no, I'm feeling pumped up now. Don't ever forget the three important H's of working out. Hydration, hydration, and more hydration. That's the best thing you can do for your body when you're doing shit like this. What's the best board game? I really like Ticket to Ride. You know, perhaps $5 ain't that much. I, I, I'd like to think it's not. Um, but, you know, don't feel bad if like you can't do that. It's totally fine. It's a, it's a double-edged sword. Part of me wishes you wouldn't do it, but part of me does. Yeah. Bro, why are you doing this? I'm on a treadmill. I'm overweight. Why wouldn't I be doing this? This is the real question. What do you think about Halo? One of my all-time favorites, right up there with Half-Life. I absolutely love the Halo series, especially the original trilogy. I've learned to appreciate four. Um, five campaign was, it just did not feel like uh, Halo to me. Infinite's pretty good. I still haven't finished it. Hey, Carl, do you play chess? No, I'm too stupid for that. Do the Halo thing. Eh. You grew up with four? Yeah, four's good. It's solid. Are you married? Yes. Have you ever played Fear and Hunger? No. I ordered an RWS sign with bullet holes a couple days ago and I cannot wait for it to arrive. Maybe it's one of the ones I shot. Thank you for ordering that, buddy. How much for you to hit the gritty? Oh, can someone remind me what hit the gritty means? God, I'm so old. You played brain damage yet? I haven't. I'm not much of a boomer shooter guy, actually despite uh, my content. Fear and Hunger is a weird game. Can you talk English? I don't understand Spanish, sorry. I, I'm not, am I speaking Spanish? What language am I speaking? I don't know. Is, the, is this Q&A on a treadmill? Yeah, pretty much. I mean, basically how it works is anyone who donates $5 to the stream will have to increase the incline. So eventually, this really starts to wear me out. Hey Carl, what food do you like? Wonderful question. Honestly, Vietnamese food is one of my favorites and it's not pho. What I really enjoy is a dish called bun. It's vermicelli. It's noodles, lettuce, pork or beef. Uh, it's got some veggies in there too. And it comes with this nice fish oil sauce. It's kind of sweet. It doesn't even taste like fish. It's my absolute favorite. Okay, Privet uh, Commander Carl. Hello. Hello, Coldat. It's good to see you again. Um, or maybe it's Coldiat. I don't know. Ben Carey. We got two bucks right there. Thank you, Ben. You're the man. Let's do this. We're at 6% now. Hoi. I still got this though. I can still handle 6%. I have a question. When ordering an RWS on bowl of holes, is there a note saying who shot it? That'd be cool. No, there isn't. Because we shoot them in bundles. We usually layer them up five to six signs at a time and shoot them. And so it's kind of hard. To, and sometimes they'll fall off the holder thing. So it's pretty hard to do that. There's really no way of telling. I think you can get one that's signed though. I'm not 100% sure. Have I played Left 4 Dead 2? Yes. Very good game. My nickname is Soldier Gaming, if translated. Oh, okay. That makes sense. I was saying Koldat. It's Soldat. <laughs> My bad. English and Russian. Sometimes I mix the letters up. Hey, Carl, can you make a reload video again? I, I've been making some. I got more in the pipeline. Keep up the training, become the Prime Minister. <laughs> yeah. Prime Minister of what? Yes, Dovahkiin, how can I help you? Uh, 
I need to go to White Run and pick up some. Are you from Texas? You're from the Grapevine area. I know Grapevine. I am from Texas. I lived in Austin, but I did live in the. I lived in Plano for a while. I'd go to Grapevine occasionally. Head to the mall there. Do you go to the gym? I don't, but I I, I do sometimes. But I feel like this is uh. I don't know. This has been a little more incentive for me to stay home. Because I can't really live stream at the gym. I'm not comfortable doing that. Have you played Half-Life? Have I played Half-Life? No, I've never heard of it. Yes, I know Sri Lanka. Hey man, proud of you. Keep up the work. Thank you. How much to climb to the Eiffel Tower? If you want to pay for my plane tickets, I'll do it for free. Prime Minister of Kick-Ass. That's right. We'll get there. Need to get like an anti-vibrating thing. Or I need to get a, what I should do is have a tripod just directly in front of the treadmill. I just, I wanna be able to see the text, especially as the stream gets more intense. More donations typically mean that uh, the incline gets steeper. Then I have to go back further because my head starts hitting the ceiling. I gotta get a better setup eventually. What's your BMI? I don't know, but it's high as fuck. Max incline, low speed, right? I, eventually I get there, yeah. Max incline is 40, I haven't gotten that high yet. I like the shaking. I need my immersion. There you go. Now it's really shaking. But I don't like the shaking. I'm not a huge fan of it. You should hang your phone from the ceiling. That's a good idea too. I could probably do that. When will you reload the dog? I, I don't know. When you did your video about getting hired at RWS, you really missed the opportunity to record you walking into Vince's office and him going, nothing personal, man, but you're fired. And I just started yesterday. You're right, that was a missed opportunity. Absolutely. Send to the treadmill under the ceiling and pop out the tile. Yeah, I could pop these tiles out eventually. And I might have to consider that. What inspired you to do the reload series? It's something that came to me, honestly. It's something I've been doing for a long time, actually. Make sure your heart rate is about 70. So you're a little out of breath. Brady, my heart rate's probably close to 100 right now. I have a higher resting heart rate than, I wouldn't say most people, but I do have a higher resting heart rate. And I think part of that is just being overweight and out of shape. And that's why I'm here. You're an amazing dude and I love how you do your reload videos. Thank you. Are you drinking water? I have not yet. I drink it once. Thank you. Mm. One for Uncle Sam. One for Bubble the Space Monkey. And one because I can. All right, we got this. Mm. Which Vince death is canon? Or is he like trans-dimensional being? <laughs> I don't know, man, it's probably, he's like uh, Kenny from South Park. You kill him, he just keeps coming back. Cool beard, thank you. Thank you very much. Can you go out of bounds and climb through the tiles? I can't do it on command. I need I need a lot of time to edit that. If Carl keeps this up, he's gonna look like a fucking Kratos. Dude, that would be so dope. If I get really buff, I am going to cosplay as Kratos. I haven't even played God of War, but I know it's a good game. It's just, it's not my type of game but I know it's good and I know I'm missing out. So yeah, that's, that's, that's the plan. Okay. Let's see. We are at 6% incline, three miles an hour. I think I'm going to hold this thing for a little bit, bro. What's your favorite ammo? I really enjoy, um, seven, six, two by 51. It's a nice balanced caliber, not too big, but not too small. Glad I can make it to a stream. I'm glad you're here. I think my moderator's here. Corrupted. Did I make you a mod? I think I might have. 
Well, you're hired anyway, even if I didn't. Sorry, but what is your weight? I'm happy to share that. I started, I was at close to 270 about two months ago. That's the heaviest set I've ever been. I am in the 250s now. I think I'm 258. Have you ever played the other TF2 <laughs> Titanfall 2? I haven't, but I've seen people play it. You have air conditioner? Oh, somewhere in here I have a vent. Maybe I don't. Who cares? It's in the basement. It stays cooler down here anyway. You go, boy. My goal is to cosplay Azura from Azura's Wrath. Nice. Bros. Now, this is an interesting idea. Treadmill gaming. I have no idea logistically how I'll do this, but it'd be pretty funny to actually be on a treadmill while playing something. Maybe that's something I'll do, you know, someday. But right now, my focus is just getting this weight off because this has got to go. This shit's got to go, man. Are you dieting too? What are you eating? Um, I'm doing about 80% healthy, 20% splurge meals. So uh, grilled chicken, broccoli, rice, um, healthy carbs occasionally, but not too many of those. I'm just sort of following my intuition. You guys have to understand, I did personal training for two years, about seven or eight years ago. So I remember a lot from that. Oh boy, what do we got? That was $10, I think. Krishna Sagar. I really appreciate that, man. From India. Love, love the idea of going to India someday. Very fascinating country. $12, okay, cool. Let's go ahead and increase that by, let's see. Conversion rate would put that at 8.5% incline. Now this is where things start getting a little difficult. I'm at 8% going three miles an hour. And I'm definitely starting to feel it now, but I got it, you know, I got this. You guys have to understand. I mean, there was a lot of concern for my health yesterday, but trust me, I know my body, I know my limits. I know when to stop when I need to. Vamil Vamilator, I'm inclined to send you this. That's great. Look at that. That is, that's about $10. So, what was that, 36, now it's at 45. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. Now we're at 10. 10.5%. Let's keep it going, baby. Hey, come to Sri Lanka when you go to India too. I'd love to. One of my good childhood friends was from Sri Lanka. Thank you, David. Yeah, I realized um, if I just remember the number, I don't know if you guys see the number up there, but I see a number of how many people, like how much is donated. YouTube does the conversions automatically. So if I was to get another 100 SEK, which I think is Swedish kroner, I don't know for sure. Then that's another $9.40 that it'll automatically add to that. And that will be another 2% incline increase. Really feeling it now. Usually when it gets to about 15%, that is, that's about the time I need to start slowing down the speed because it just gets to be so much. It is Swedish, good, I was right. Good, good. We got 200 people here now. Hello everybody, glad you guys are here. Thank you for joining me on this journey, becoming a better version of myself. Man, is a bugged NPC. No, I am not. Hello, traveler. No, I'm not, what are you talking about? God, why do people always say that about me? Talking and walking on tremolo is actually tough. Good on you. It is, it can be a little hard. But the, the, the thing of it is, is that the talking actually helps me push through the pain a little bit better than I normally would be able to. So I can't complain too much. Please sign this petition. I have a petition in my office. It's the same layout. It says, petition to cancel Commander Carl for making shitty submarine jokes. Because I was one of the lot who made shitty distasteful submarine jokes when the Titan sub shit happened. Which, 
Probably wasn't my best call, but hey, man. There's one thing I've learned about life. Just try to not take everything so seriously. I mean, even when my own mother died, it sucked for a little while, but I can enjoy a good dead mom joke. It doesn't bother me at all. Do you think Reddit should exist? I do. I think Reddit's a really useful use source. But for some reason, everybody on Reddit is so goddamn angry. And I don't know why. Every time I go there to, like, learn something or get answers, I almost always leave Reddit feeling worse. Because everyone on there is just so hostile and angry. And yeah, you're right. Twitter has uh, Poison Third says, same as Twitter. Twitter has become a very negative place lately. Walk while holding your cock. <laughs> okay. The helmet's not stuck to my head. It's... Oh, shit. Okay, the helmet's stuck to my head. I'm kidding. Okay. Just to... Um, let you guys know, we're at 10.5%, still going three miles an hour. <sighs> I'm definitely feeling it now. Um, but honestly, this isn't anything I can't handle. But I'm definitely getting sweaty, which is good. Do I watch UFC? I don't. I've never really been interested in it. But I don't judge people who do. And I know that it's like a legitimate thing. It's just not my thing. Were the Callisto Protocol team mostly using Maya or Blender? What a fantastic question. It was mostly Maya, but we did have a couple people using Blender for some of the uh, hard surface stuff because Blender has a really excellent hard surface suite that you can download called uh, Hard Ops. This thing's getting noisy. Hold on guys. Belt's getting a little off center. There we go. Just had to reload the treadmill quick. Sweating is a good way to burn fat. That's why I'm here, my guy. Army person, let's go. Don't. I'm not in the army. I never have been. I thankfully have managed to avoid being accused of stolen valor. Um, but yeah, I've never been in the armed forces. I'm more of a person who appreciates the armed forces and guns and people who've been in the armed forces. It's just part of the online persona. I just, I adapted it. Keep going. I am, don't worry. I ain't stopping. We're gonna keep going. I'm a blender defector and on Maya now. I love them almost equally. Do you like blender or Maya more? I'd be curious to know. What's your favorite gun? Mine is the LMG and the minigun. I love miniguns. I've shot them twice now, and they're a lot of fun. And I love LMGs. When I was at the range day, there was a there was an FN Mini Me, which is the Belgian version of the M249 Squad Automatic Weapon, which actually the Mini Me came first. The Americans copied the design because it was so solid. But I put 150 rounds through that thing. Woo! That was fun. I love your shoes. Isn't the hat warm? Yeah, it's getting pretty warm under there. Clearly is American. What gave that away? The fact that I like guns or the fact that I'm very overweight. You have nice eyeballs. Would you like one? Ugh. Are you an AR or an AK kind of guy? I've always loved the AKs. I have a uh, Bulgarian one. Absolutely fantastic rifle. It's a milled receiver, folding stock. Mm, it's gorgeous. Wow, I've got 350 people here. I don't think the number's ever been that high before. What's your favorite gun? Oh, it's been a lot over the years, but I'd have to say the M60. I love M60s. And I wanted to shoot the one at range day. It was Brandon's uh, M60, but it was being kind of fussy. So I didn't get to shoot it. I did take a picture with it though. Oh, we went, as soon as I said 350 people, it jumped down to 270. 
They're like, nah, I ain't gonna wash this fat ass. <laughs> Oop, I swore, sorry. Have you tried Daewoo K2? No, I have not. You seem like you're from the East Coast. I'm not, I'm from Texas. But most of my parents are from the East Coast. So maybe that's uh, why you're getting that. I'm gonna get this treadmill straightened out. Mm. What object are you, reload are you most proud of? That's hard to say. The vacuum, I guess, because that's the one that kept me my start. $5, might try to work out with you if I can catch the streams. Mainly pull-ups, push-ups, and sit-ups. That's what I'm talking about, man. Thank you, Lion Tamer. Much appreciated. $5 means another incline increase by 1%, which puts us at 11.5. Still at three miles an hour. Definitely sweating now. You can't really see too well, but I'm definitely getting sweaty. That's good. But when you're getting sweaty, always remember. The three important ages, working out. Hydrate, hydrate, and hydrate. Oh, there we go. Whew. This is good. Got about 10 minutes left. If you respond to my text, I will subscribe. Hello, Jason Aylers. If you subscribe, I appreciate it. Every subscriber counts. What's your favorite FPS game? Love your content, by the way. Half-Life 2 has always been my number one. What do I think of Half-Life 2? It's tattooed on my arm. I should say enough what I think about it. One million subs. Yeah, dude, when I hit one million, oh, shit's gonna go cray cray. I can't wait to hit that. 10 minutes, I know. At this rate, this is definitely an easier workout than yesterday. Commander, how was the range with gun tubers? I was just talking about that about two minutes ago. It's fantastic, it was a dream come true. I've gotten to shoot basically every machine gun I dreamed of as a kid. Any indie games on your radar? Not really. I don't, I don't really play indie games that much, but I know I should. I do not play Call of Duty Modern uh, M. Uh, I think that means modern. You must have forgotten the W. <laughs> what do we got? Donut Thunder. Commander Carl gets power up. <laughs> Minus fat plus strong and cool. Thanks, my guy. I couldn't do this if it wasn't for you guys pushing me. All the messages of support, every other form of support. Super appreciative. How much that 50 cal kick back? It wasn't that bad, honestly. I would say a 12 gauge is worse. Dance like Michael Jackson for $50. No. Do you play War Thunder? I don't. I don't play many online games. The worst thing that can happen when playing HL2 is your game glitches at the trumpet part and it's midnight. When the game glitches, all you can hear is the trumpets. What? I don't remember any trumpets in Half-Life 2. Favorite guns has been asked. What about favorite gun sound? Ooh. I gotta say, I do love, I lo do love the sound of a Tommy gun. Either the M1A1 or the 1928 A1, either one. Favorite water brand? Actually, that's not a dumb question at all. Ozarka. Ozarka for the win. Texas water. I gotta go. Bye, Carl. Thanks, Legos and Blocks. Lego Blocks and Bricks. Appreciate you stopping by. Oh, God. What's going on here? Treadmill stream, my guy. I'm inclined at 11.5% going three miles an hour. It's harder than it looks, especially for a fat dude. Do you ever wear the helmet? No, I don't wear it all the time. Just on special occasions. Come on, boy, run. I'm working up to that. I really like walking at an incline. For me, it feels more effective. 
but eventually I am gonna start running. And instead of incline increases, we'll do speed increases. I thought bro was born with the helmet. <laughs> Maybe. You play Guardian Tales? No, I don't. Have you ever done any programming coding? No, I've tried. I never got into programming. I'm just an artist. Yes, I'm a system of a down. Amazing band. I wish they played more. Do you play G.O.W.? Which G.O.W.? God of War or Gears of War? If it's Gears of War, yes, I play a lot of that. You play Doom? Yep, I have. Works in quads better walking at an incline than running. I know, exactly. And I want giga legs. I want some thunder thighs. What was the last game you played? Yesterday night I played some cyberpunk. I really enjoy that game. Did you have to get into the blueprint system in Unreal? I look at it with sneer because I coded a lot in the past. You know, um, when it comes to coders, what I've heard them say about Unreal's blueprints is that it's like learning programming all over again. Very mixed feelings on blueprints from all the coders I've talked to. I think I'm getting real out of breath now. That's good. But don't worry, I got a handle on this. I know when to stop if I need to. <sighs> Do I play old God of War? No, I don't. What's one game animation you worked on you're most proud of? I'm not an animator. I'm actually just a 3D artist. Um, there's this really cool asset I made for Callisto Protocol. I don't know if I can talk about it because pretty much perpetually under NDA. But that's one that I'm probably most proud of. What's your opinion on HL2DM? Counter-Strike Source? Never played HL2DM? Played the shit out of Counter-Strike Source. I played a lot of Counter-Strike back in the day. Dude, how long have you been going? 32 minutes. Well, 30 minutes on the treadmill, actually, so 30. I respect the grind. Reminds me that I should work out also. It's, it's a good thing to do, man. You know, I've stood in my own way for so long now. And I've held myself back. And the only way I'm gonna go forward is to stop holding myself backward. I actually had a pretty funny thing happen today. Um, I came across a video of a podcaster named Sam Hyde. I never actually heard of him until today. And this dude was talking all sorts of shit about me. About how, like, he hates my reload animations, thinks I'm a, a gay polycule or something that lures six-year-olds into my Subaru. <laughs> I, I couldn't help but just laugh. Because, like, I don't know who this guy is. He's judging me based off of just the content he's seen and not really of my actual personality. And like, oh, normally I would think of some way to be retaliatory, but I'm not gonna stoop to that level. You just gotta learn to laugh about it, man. Besides, he just seems like an angry, bitter old man. And I'm not much different there. That's why I'm on here. You crying? Do I look like I'm crying, boy? I'm sweating, dude. I'm sweating my fucking ass off. No, I'm not crying. Why would you say that? Do a range vid with Donut and Herrera. I'm working on that. Uh, Corridor Digital was there. They got a lot of footage that had me in it that I wasn't able to get myself. So I talked to... Uh, one of the people, Corridor Digital, and they told me I'll be able to use some of the footage that has me in it. So I'm waiting for them to chomp that away and then I'll be able to post my range day video. I'm eating cake and watching this. <laughs> I 
I'm sweating from my eyeballs. Yes, exactly. That's a great alternative to crying. I'm not crying, I'm just sweating from my eyeballs. I'm tired of looking at all the, of the world. Commander, what is your favorite Fallout game? Fallout 3. I know I'm gonna get crucified for this, but I think it's the best Fallout. Um, but I realize, I know that Fallout New Vegas is really awesome, so don't crucify me, I just never played it. $20, oh man. Someone just came in clutch for the last bit of the stream here. $20, whew, that's a 4% increase. So we are at 15.5. Now shit's gonna get real. 15.5 at three miles an hour. I'm really working now. This is one hell of an incline. Whew. And I've got about two minutes left before cooldown starts. I got this. I can do this. Do not die. We cannot go without you. I'll be fine. Fallout 2 is... By a, I have never played Fallout 2, but I'm sure it's probably the best. Would you ever do a Let's Play Live? Live or not? Sure. Okay, guys, we got... 30 seconds left. If anyone wants to donate for more incline increases, now's the chance. Otherwise, I'm gonna cut that off. I'm not even gonna change the speed. I'm gonna keep it at three. Fifteen seconds. I got this. Yes, I played TF2. I do not have any other helmets. Five, four, three, two, one. Holy shit. Whew. What a work. That was good. That was good. Mm. Thank you guys. Let's cool down and chat a little, huh? Take this damn helmet off. Oh, we did it. We did it. Day three. Day three, massive success. Hands are drenched in sweat. Okay. Calorie count, 251 calories burned. Not bad, not bad at all. That was actually how much I had for breakfast, so I just burned my whole breakfast off. off. We need to get Carl an Alton helmet. Can't say I know what that is. Maggot! Are you doing this every day from when to when? I'm doing it Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, from about 9 a.m. to, you know, 10-ish a.m. Because I wanna take time to cool down, answer, excuse me, answer questions. It's a little harder to answer questions when I'm going Full speed here. Good job, I'll probably donate next stream. You don't have to, but obviously it's appreciated, my guy. Have you heard of Tally Hall? No, I haven't. What I think of Gary's Mod? Love Gary's Mod. I've been playing Gary's Mod since version five, which came out in like 2005. I've been playing the game a long time. Um, and I have a player's, mo I have a player's model. Uh, one of my fans made a player model out of me, so any Gary's Mod fans out there, just search up Commander Carl. What made you start YouTube? It's a really, really great question. I actually did YouTube 10 years ago under, the, uh, under a different alias. I made Gary's Mod movies. The channel's name was Big Red Jew. Um, I mean, that was, that was over 10 years ago, and I got pretty far. I got 20,000 subs. I got other Gmod movie makers to notice me and some of them even follow me. And that was great. But then I started to uh, burn out. Uh, I noticed that I'd put like a week, two weeks work into a video and then it would just get like nothing in terms of views. And that was really discouraging. And eventually I quit and I gave up. Then all this reload stuff happened a decade later, 
I started posting it to YouTube, it shot up there. I got to 20,000 subs really quickly, then 40,000, then 100,000. And so YouTube came back into my life and I'm not giving it up this time. I can't do that again. I've given up on so many things in my freaking life. So many, I've given up on weight loss. I've given up on YouTube. No, I'm talking about back then, not now. I don't want this to be recorded and taken out of context. I gave up on those things and I'm not doing that again. I just, I kicked myself for it because I can't imagine where I would be now if I never threw in the towel. So, yeah, <laughs> proud toilet seat. I think I saw you once and forgot about it, then saw you again when you were featured on Daily Dose. <laughs> yeah, I got featured on Daily Dose. People tell me that's when you know you've made it is when you've been featured on Daily Dose. And it's a, you also know you've made it when you have other big content creators and live streamers talking shit about you. <sighs> I'm actually going to make a video about the Sam Hyde thing. Cause it's pretty funny. I, I feel like I should share it. Maybe I'll like, I'll just like a quick react video. <laughs> I just, he keep, I keep laughing at when he said that I look like a guy who lures six year olds into Subarus. I mean, I have to lure my kids into my Subaru. So, I mean, he's not like entirely wrong there, but I don't lure other kids. Just mine. Cause someone's got to take them to school. You're a good guy, Commander. I try, man. I try. I don't know if you remember me from last stream, but I lost a few more pounds and I now weigh 139. That's what I'm talking about. You look like you like sports. I actually don't. I used to play tennis in high school. So that's it. I don't really watch sports. A lot of people say I look like they're uh, high, school, high school coaches. I get that so many times. This is just... People will tell me this guy looks like my uncle or this guy looks like my, my uh, high school coach. And I don't really know how to take comments like that. I just sort of smirk and move on. Post, posting again. You know how that sometimes you need to quit to know how to succeed. Thank you. I know. Uh, failure is a very important ingredient to success, but that does not make failure feel any better. I did not know you had kids. I do. I've got two boys. And uh, I, uh, I got I to gotta lose this weight because having my kids see me overweight, not being able to keep up with them when we're playing, nah, -uh. nope. Not to mention, you know, dying from fucking heart. I swore, my bad, from freaking heart failure or something. I love your content. What kind of programs you do for weight loss journey? I don't have programs. I've done personal training about seven or eight years ago. I saw a lot of results with that. When my kids came around, the weight came back and it came back with friends. So I am not doing any programs. I'm rolling on my own for now because I think I can make some good progress. When I plateau, I will consider probably personal training eventually. You're running so fast you made an earthquake, not in a rude way. <laughs> Thanks, I guess. Try cooking a carbonara sometime. It's really easy, filling a delicious recipe. Thank you, I'll do that. Okay, I'm gonna cut the stream in about two minutes. I just wanna answer a few more questions. Hey, my dad works out. He uses P90X and Beastbody. I recommend those. I've heard about P90X. That's something I could definitely consider. Imagine if he was a villain, he'd use 0.0001% of his power. The world would explode. Yeah, we'll roll with that, buddy. <laughs> Recommend eating more eggs. Yes, eggs are an extremely powerful source of protein and pretty much no carbs, as far as I know. So yeah, eggs are great because eggs have to grow an entire animal. So there's a lot of very potent uh, protein source in there. The dude, try not to spam, please. Yeah, if anyone's uh, 
anyone spamming corrupted, you can go ahead and give them the you know, give them the silent treatment, you know. Put them in timeout for a little bit, but we don't need to worry about that now cuz stream's about to end. Whew. At least Carl would not time out me for saying woke. That word is thrown around so much by by the right. It, it, I don't even think they know what it means, to be honest, but <laughs> I don't want to make anything political. I, I've made it clear where I stand on the political spectrum. I love guns. I think everyone who isn't hurting anyone should have the right to live their life uh, freely, regardless of their religion, sexual orientation, race, otherwise. I think we all need to love each other, love ourselves, respect one each other, respect ourselves. And we need to fight the worst evils of all. Kitty diddlers, rapists, tyrannical leaders, that stuff. That's what I think. What's your favorite song to listen to while working out? The cyberpunk soundtrack is very good, especially the radio soundtracks. The Dirge is really great. Some really wonderful songs on there. Uh, God, just cyberpunk's combat music is even really awesome. Good stuff. You are a good American. Thank you. I try. What do you think of the GTA 6 trailer? I'm really interested to see how the game's actually going to look compared to the trailer. Because one thing I noticed about that trailer is that that game was using some really advanced lighting technology that still isn't widely available yet. It's known as ray tracing. What this does is it simulates the way light bounces in the real world. But it takes a lot of computing power to do that. We're only just having the hardware to be able to do real-time ray tracing. So I'm really curious to see if they used ray tracing to enhance the trailer or if they're actually working on like a real-time solution. Chris, is that you? You got $1,000. No, I only got 70 bucks, which is a lot. So I don't want to make it sound like that's nothing because that's a lot, a lot of money. $70 is a lot, and I'm very grateful for that. So thank you, guys. Um, in addition to these treadmill streams, I'd like to start streaming other stuff. Um, I really want to get back into Twitch. I, you're right. You can do a lot for 70 bucks. So, anyways. Um, hold on. That's a very long Russian name. That's too hard to read for me. Hello, a couple times I saw you answering in Russian, and I didn't understand you. Just know a few words, or can you not speak Russian if it's not diff I can't speak Russian, but I can read it. I don't know if I'm reading it correctly. I know there's a lot of rules. Um, you know, every language has rules that you need to adhere to. Um, but yeah, I want to do Twitch. I want to live stream on YouTube, just maybe like while I'm working and just chill with you guys, just hang out because I don't know, it's fun connecting with y'all. And I think it's a good way to put myself out there more. I, it's one of the things I feel like has been holding me back as a creator is not putting myself out there more to people. Um, I've just been kind of hunkering in my own little sphere and it's time to come out of that, you know? Who's my favorite YouTuber? I've got a few and I can proudly say I'm friends with pretty much all of them now. Uh, we've got John Tron. I've always loved John Tron. I've watched him since like 2014. Actman, who I actually went to the range day with. I met him for the first time in person. We both just, him and uh, his brother Connor, who goes by Act Bro, um, were both there. So we all just hung out and shot guns. It was great. Um, I'll have some videos of Actman on my upcoming video. Yeah, John Tron's great. I've talked with him a few times. I told I told him that like I'd love to collab someday. He's down, but I think John Tron is an exceptionally busy guy who tries to stay off the internet as much as he can. He does not answer DMs very often. <laughs> so, but he's a good guy. I like John. Um, hopefully someday I'll actually get to meet him in person. Um, and Mudahar, I like Mudahar a lot. I haven't been watching him as long as uh, Act Man or John Tron. But um, I have talked with him a few times now. We follow each other on Twitter. He was going to be at the range day, but he must have not made it. Um, so hopefully next time I'll get to see him. Um, yeah, Mood is a good guy. Can you make some gaming streams? That's, that's what I was talking about earlier. I'm, I do plan to do some streaming on Twitch. 
I have a Twitch already. It's at 1,300 followers. I'm an affiliate, but I never use it. And I think, I think it's time I, I utilize that because um, I really need to, like I said, connect with my audiences more. And I need to just maximize all the resources I, ha resources I have as a creator because I'm not doing that right now. Or I, rather, I just started. Okay, live's been 50 minutes now. I think it's time to go ahead and call it a day. I gotta go get some food, um, among other things. Uh, so um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna call it a day for now. Um, I'm taking Saturday, Sunday off of the treadmill stream, but I'll be back Monday at around 9 a.m. Uh, Central Time. So I'm just gonna slide this in. Man, look at this guy, kilobyte cash. Just donating just for the hell of it, man. I really appreciate that, buddy. For you, I'm going to start the next stream at 2% incline. I'll remember that. So thank you so much, uh, Kilobyte Cash. Thank you, everyone who's donated to the stream. Thank you, everyone who's come to cheer me on and just shoot the shit and talk. Swore again. Shoot the crap and talk shop. I really appreciate that. You guys are the best. Uh, please look forward to more content from me soon. Uh Gonna kind of hit the ground running on some more stuff. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, until then, I'll uh, I'll look forward to seeing you guys again on any form of live. Commander out. <laughs>